Here's a look at your Thursday as a whole. Another hot, less humid day. Plenty of sunshine. 87 is where we'll land by the day's end. And yesterday, some of you tied and broke those daytime high records. We could be doing so again today. We'll have to see where we land. Overnight tonight, though, mostly clear. 59 degrees is what we'll drop back to as tomorrow. We'll stay dry, quiet, plenty of sunshine, low humidity. We're going to add in a little bit more of a breeze tomorrow, but all in all, a beautiful Friday. We're going to then start off Saturday dry and quiet, but our next system will be approaching. We have a cold front that will move through. That's going to drop back our temperatures and bring in some showers and possible storms Saturday afternoon and evening could even linger a bit with a few showers on Sunday, but our rainfall totals, they're not high. We're talking a quarter to a half an inch of rainfall. Our models are not puting out uh, a lot of moisture here, so not a big heavy hitting rainfall event for over the weekend. Plus on Saturday, Riverbank run. I know it's a big day for plenty of you runners out there. Maybe even our warmer, one of our warmer Riverbank runs will be in the 60s and dry for our, our race time, gaining cloud cover as the day goes on, working to those showers and storms. But I think for the race, we should be dry, a little bit warm, and not humid, so not terrible running conditions. Next week, though, we're going to drop back closer to average. We should be about 69 degrees this time of year, so we'll be in the 60s next week.